Hey guys, Mystic Shots here, and today I am here, and I will be um, reading the. I am here, and I will be reading the Cronorium, and um, this is live. Um, and um, yeah, if I can't read some of the words because they're German and stuff, but um, yeah. But let's just go with 22 minutes of gameplay. So you guys will see some old gameplay in the background. It's not live. Maybe later I'll do live. But this is okay. Anyway, um, I'll put the HUD down. Hold on. Forgot how to disable it in this. Hold on. Okay, hold on. B to toggle HUD. Okay, hold on. Okay, I need to find a way to turn this off. First person. Okay. So, A to play. Okay, so let's get. Okay, let's start reading. But, um, yeah, let's read. Um. Okay, here we go. In the beginning, there was only the Ether and the Keepers. Among them were two beings who would later be known by mayonnaise. One would be known as Dr. Monty and the other as the Shadow Man. September 3rd, 580. <sighs> Knowing the planet has a gateway to Arthur. 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 The path going to send meteors of element 1152. They believe humanity will only day, will one day use element 115 to wage war among themselves, opening the rift that will allow the apothecaries to escape the dark, the dark ether. January 5th, 1292. The great war between humanity and the apothecaries began. April 14th, 12th. 94. Sir Pablo, I'm not going to pronounce his last name, is saved from the clutches of a Margo by the four unknown heroes. They would later become known as Primus. Together with the Keepers, Primus def okay, December 31st, 1299. Together the Keeper's premise defeated the Apothecans, bringing the Great War to an end. January 1st, 13,000. Before they seemingly disappear from history, Primus instructs the Wolf King to begin building Dorizondrak. Honoring the Wolf... Okay, September 19th, 1318. Honoring the Wolf's dying request, his loyal servant, Arthur, which is Leroy from Buried, um, scatters... Buries his bones in the ground of Durizendrak, accompanied by the wolf, the king's wolf. September 20th, 1318. Tele temporal rifts teleport there to Resolution 1295, which is buried in 2025. Um, a meteor containing, okay, June 30th, 1908. A meteor containing element 115 crashes near a st stony Tung Tungushika River. Okay, August 30th, 1925. Doctor Ed Dr. Edward Richthofen joins the Illuminati. That's the 1.0 version from like World War, or World at War, Black Ops 1, you know, stuff like that. But, um, um, so February 4th, 1931, large deposits of element 115 are discovered near, I'm not going to try to pronounce it, Germany. Dr. Ludwig Max is, is a German scientist and is sent to investigate. Okay, Max is... May 10th, 1931, Maxis forms a group 935, an experimental organization 
deciding to, st to study element 115. Maxis tells his scientists they represent the future of technology advancements and will be pioneers of human discovery. The group swears to work in securely from their respective or governments as Maxis says, we cannot afford the, to let this power fall in the wrong hands. Samantha Maxis is born, her mother dies in childbirth. Maxis invites Rick Toffin to join group 935. He agrees, secretly acting on behalf of Element 1, or on behalf of the Illuminati. April 10th, 1937, the Imperial Japanese Army discovers Element 115 meteor fragments in a swamp within Japanese territory. They built the Rising Sun facility to continue research. Division 9 is created to oversee its operation. The United States Go- Okay, June 14th, 1937, the United States government discovers deposits of Element 115 at Groom Lake, Nevada. Maxis and Rick Toffin begin teleportation experiments with the matter trans transfer trans prototype to that's basically a teleport to mild success. The su subjects are teleported, but their chemical composition is altered, giving them a basically and um August fifth. 1939, using element 115, Maxis and Richthofen resurrect one of the teleported corpses. For, uh, for the first time, uh, they, yeah. <laughs> sorry, I was laughing at the gameplay. But, um, let's go, let's go back to where it was. Where was I? Okay. Iller, it obeys. But soon becomes a rabid rabbit and attacks them. The test subject is killed. Okay. <clears throat> so it's, hold on, I'm gonna get a drink. I'm gonna pause the gameplay. I'm gonna get a drink, guys. So it's... Or you and me, guys, I'm just gonna keep the gameplay going. I got a little bit of water. Oh. Anyway, um... Yeah, put the hut up there. You guys like the hut or without the hut? Okay, anyway, let's get it. Let's take it. Okay, Rick, okay, September 3rd, 1939. Rick Toffin okay. begins development of the Wonder Wolf DG2. Maxis turns to Rick Toffin for additional or Rick Stag for additional fundraising. Germany agrees to agrees to the request, expressing interest in their weapon research. Okay, teleportation technology in the rem uh, hold on. And the reanimated undead subjects. During test trial, hold on. 151. Uh, Coffin and Dr. Scust successfully teleport the walnut. This is the first successful teleport 
test for the chemical composition of this object is a main subject throughout the process. Edward Walnut. Okay. okay. December 5th, 1939. Edward's Walnut delivery fails to impress Maxis, who decides it was a, or declares it was a waste of time. He reveals to Calvin that Grid 95 was soon funded by German, Germany. Richthofen worried this will be massive. He and Scott decided to get to use their teleportation experiment behind Maxis' back. January 4th, 1940, Richthofen and. Okay, Richthofen and Dr. S is what I'm gonna call for now. Conduct their first human teleportation test. Richthofen is so confident in its success, he volunteers the MPD the pyramid hidden by the Apotheans. While inspecting the device, Richthofen is elect or electrocuted and begins hearing the many voices of corruption, including that of the Shadow Man. The device then teleports him to Shangri La, corrupted by dark ether. Richthofen is gradually being driven insane by an obsession find it. Agartha. January 5th, 1940. Richthofen is worshipped by natives of Shangri La. An altar is built in his name. Richthofen encounters the focusing stone for the first time. January 23rd, 1940. After a near month of absence, Richthofen returns to Dr. S with a plan to build Griffin Station. Richthofen okay. Richthofen renounces his involvement when asked how he could abandon his obligation to the order he says Teddy with was a liar March 13th 1940 the construction of Griffin Station on the moon begins fresh with Maxis's eligible and with Germany or alignment with Germany. Other discreet group 95 scientists joined the cause. July 13th, 1940, Maxis, Maxis instructs his assistant Sophia to write a Letter to Richthofen, High Command, or Richthofen, High Command, requesting additional funds. Through he, though he reports the mass production will soon be underway shortly. Doris lacks not only the fundings but significant. Volunteers of Element 115, or Valiants of Element 115. <sighs> August 1st, 1940. In response to Maxis's request, Germany creates two new facilities for Group 935. They are the Kino. They are the Kino facility, a repurposed theater, and the asylum facility at the uh, in somewhere in in Berlin, Berlin. Um, August eighteenth, nineteen forty. As per Germans' request, the Japanese Imperial Army hands over the Rising Sun facility to Group Nine Three Five. Division Nine remains involved on site. Group Nine Three Five establishes a research facility. Sub Siberia near the Tagash 
Group 935 establishes a research facility at Horizon Drac, which has been overrun now by um, Group 935, I guess. Um, Nikolai Belinsky's wife is killed during the German advance in this, the Soviet Union. In effort to numb uh, Nikolai increases turn or increasingly turns to vodka, which is the 1.0 in um, Rick Johnson, by the way. Okay, vodka, vodka. Okay, Maxis. Okay. January 11th, 1942, Maxis gives Sloppy to Samantha. The dog is expecting a litter, which is, if you guys don't know, puppies. Um. Um, hold on. Let's see how far we. Okay. Let me just get a drink. Hold on. I guess we got a lot of stuff. Okay. Maxis. Test, okay, January 20th, 1942. Maxis test the first file for store on the data. Servant. January 26th, 1942. On the data serve. Maxis catalog location. From prominent element 115 deposit. He includes information about his various applications and cited that the remaining of the dead cells is a possible side effect. January 30th, 1942, Rick Dolphin completes the Wonder Wolf DG2 prototype, which is the Wonder Weapon from um, Giant Darius, you know. Anyway, um, Wonder Wolf DG2 prototype, okay, February 1st, 1942, with prefestation complete. Coffin names Dr. Groff, lead scientist, and returns to Earth. Continue the character or the cherry with Maxis working alongside Dr. S. Groff is left to decide with power of the or discover the power of the MPD. February 2nd, 1942. Speech to his staff. Groff talks uh, optimistically about Griffin Station establishment as a base of operation. Maxis develops a ray gun prototype as the right at the Rising Sun facility. Each uh, Porter works on the development of the second generation model. Raygun Mark II. Or the Porter's Ray Gun thing. A result of Tim what's his pack punch? As a result okay. June thirteenth, nineteen forty two. A result of temporal rifts in nineteen sixty three. Kino more okay, Monte reaches across time and offers little nudges. One nudge is developing groups 935's element 115 fused egg list colors. They create four uh, medical beverages known as Juggernog, Quick Revive, Speak Cola, and Double Tap. June 28, 1942. Group 935 development. Of a weapon upgrading machine. Pack a punch. Dr. S. Um, unwillingly discover how to charge an PD when 
Thanks. Dr. Vest kills a rat near the device. Death immediately begins filling the tank. Rick Toffin changed change the device. They reported their findings to Rick Toffin. Rick, okay. July 20th, 1942. 1.0 Rick Toffin begins sending soldiers and scientists to the moon to be sacrificed. Their soul is used to charge the MPD. Takio. Okay. Takio Masaki. Okay, let's continue reading, sorry. Okay. Takio Makasaki is, um... Takio is dispatched by the Emperor. The Emperor to oversee the work of Group 935 and Division 9 at the right side. December 8th, 1942, Rick Thomas shares the Element 115 based elixir recipes with Griffin Station. They just develop Mule Kick. My brother is killed in the Battle of Stalingrad. Okay, that was December 9th, 1942. December 14th, 1942. Rick Toffin creates the Monkey Bomb. December 16th, 
personal log Maxis expresses concern over element 115's impact on Rick Toffin's behavior. No longer trusting him, he worries if it was a mistake to invite him to group 935. December 20th, 1942. That's the end of the game right there. But, um, hold on, yeah, let's end. Huh. play and let's play um, giant okay let's start game okay long ago on the Come. battlefield by Sophia Two Sophia let's get a little far in the gameplay I'll, I'll talk about some what I think of it so far so guys um Basically what I've been reading so far, if you guys, uh, um, I'll be up on this YouTube probably later tonight or, um, I've been reading about the, um, I've been reading the Cronorium, which is, um, basically has everything to do with the zombie storyline, and, um, as you guys can see, I like zombies because of, um, this, but let's get that, and, um, blood, double points for later, and, um, um, Origins is also being remastered in a DLC 5, which I cannot wait to see come out, and, um, yeah, it's coming out, I think, hold on, I think it's coming out May 13th, I'm not sure, and today is, hold on, let me check today's date, pause the gameplay, today is... The seventh, so not too far away, actually. So it's pretty soon, but um, there's already some people have that have gameplay of DLC five coming out. So it's just a bunch of remaster map there. Which um, oh yeah, I did say I was gonna make another video on this, so let's just talk in the, about it in this video. So one of the DLC maps is um is um this map right now, right here. Origins. Hold on. Okay, more ammo. Origins, um, which is um one of my favorite Black Ops new zombie maps, and um another one is um so there's Notch Darnto and Keen Darnto and Origins. Um, let's see. Let's go. Okay, so hold on. I gotta find it. Hold on. Map. I'm trying to find the maps. Okay, not Star and Toten. Verrucked. Shino Numa, Kino Jototen, Ascension, Shangri La, Moon, Origins. Those are the maps. But, anyways, um. Let's keep talking. But, but yeah. So, what do you guys think of this? Are you guys gonna be getting DLC 5? When it comes out, let me know. And, um. Uh, of course, it's coming to PS4 first because it's um, Call of Duty's deal with um, PlayStation right now. That all their um, DLCs come to um, PlayStation first. But, um, yeah. Anyway, um, so I gotta get that zombie blood and, um, where was I? But, yeah, I'm definitely gonna be checking out that DLC 5. Let's see. Most likely we'll be seeing gameplay on it um, eventually soon. 
but now I have origins on the Xbox so I need to turn power on. But um yeah, basically this will be easy because I have zombie blood. But yeah, I just gotta stand right here and um they won't bother me at all and um hopefully I finish this teleporter before it runs out. Oh basically, I didn't get hurt at all. But um yeah. Basically I've been But, um, yeah. What I really wanted to see in there was Mob of the Dead, but, you know. As you guys know. Okay, hold on. Okay, hold on. I gotta go buy some more quicker vibe. But, um, that's why I don't like doing more live gameplay, because you. I have to talk, I have to focus on talking, but I also have to focus on the game at the same time. And um, yeah, just a little bit of um, extra work put in to get to play all these videos. But um, yeah, I've been um, asking if, um, uh, I asked my friend if he's getting DLC 5, and um, he said most likely because um, Origins, which is the map I'm playing right now. One of his favorite maps, it's not you don't like his old time away. favorites. One. But um yeah, um where was I? Oh yeah, um I just been um playing a lot of um Black Ops 2 recently. Especially zombies, but I've been doing a little bit of multiplayer. And um I realize how much I miss this game and um how much I wanna go back to it for a while. Let me know if you guys want to see me when I go back and be doing like maybe daily videos on this. Well, not daily, but like you know, I up you know my upload schedule is scheduled kind of messy. It's not daily. Sometimes it's daily. Sometimes it's three times a day. You know, it's just a little. It's just a really messy um, schedule. But I I did a little bit of gameplay now. Let's continue reading the book. <laughs> Hold on, let me make sure. Okay, hold on. Where was I? Let me find it. But, um. Okay. I think I found it. But, yeah, um. Nikolai is captured by German forces during the Battle of Stalingrad. He becomes a test subject in Group 935's experiment. So 1. Point, or 1.0 rigged off and or Nikolai was just captured. Max okay, January 27th, 1943. Maxis reports su success with two with two six House violent outburst have been um, greatly reduced. Maxis believes his method of treatment will be 100% effective in most cases. The bout, okay, February 2nd, or February, yes, yeah, February 2nd, 1943, the battle stopped. Ends. Maxis reports the treatment has been perfectly uh, perfected. He believes if subject two six can re retain the impresses longer than twenty six hours, then the delivery of the zombie arm or, or development, the yeah, delivery of the undead. Romy can be accelerated. February 12th, 1943, after attacking a handler, a subject 26 is killed and deemed another setback. Har okay, May 18th, or May 18th, yeah, 1943. Harvey Yanka begins his work with Group 935. June 4th, 1943. Primus arrives from 
Dimension six Dimension sixty three is which is where Mob of the Dead and Shadows of Evil take place in that dimension. And um so yeah, they just got back from that dimension. In effort to pre okay. Where was I? In effort to prevent the events Okay. The events that are about to unfold, they formulate a plan to stop the this dim the this dimension's rigged off in. Uh, okay. June 11th, 1943, Rick Coffin is contacted from the house by Maxis, who warns that the test subjects must n never be allowed to be awakened. The havoc could be upon the future be by such simple-minded individuals would be catastrophic. Takio reports to the okay June fifteenth, nineteen forty three. Takio reports to the emperor that the work is beginning done at the Rising Sun facility is unacceptable. June nineteenth, nineteen forty three. Primus Richtofen, which is two point zero Richtofen, is teleported to the house in Agartha, reuniting him with Maxis. June 24, 1943, on the or orders of the Emperor, Takio is taken prisoner by Group 935 and Division 9. He is used as a test subject for experiments, which we see in, um, which we see in, hold on, I got to get it, it's not my map name. It was this Japanese map of Black Ops 3, it's just that. Oh, I was, I played it for a while and I actually liked it. I forgot what it was. Because I haven't played Black Ops 3 Zombies in a long time. It was like, Zetsubo no Shima. Yeah, Zetsubo no Shima. Um, Return of basically a giant tree thing. After the sub, after the setbacks with Subject 2-6, Maxis reports new success with the undead army. However, he maintains his belief that the undead cannot be controlled or maintained. September 2nd, 1944. Pablo, a Mexican spy, is captured by Group 935 at the Rising Rock. May 19th, 1945. In his cell, Pablo writes of visions of a great war, describes a great battle against strange demon-like creatures who were trying to devour the earth in his vision. He sees four knights protecting him from a certain death. He makes a note that the knights wrote war tunics similar to those in the Rock. June 14th, or June 4th, 1945, notched her own token. An hour an allied plane malfunction over an airfield and crashes. Germany, German army trucks are transporting the undead of an element 1.15 group between group 935 facility is struck in a struck a struck and struck in the crash. The marines the marines survived the crash. Hold out against the undead as long as they can. Peter McCain, in, okay, June seventeenth, nineteen forty-two. Peter McCain infiltrates Group ninety-five at Darius. And let's do some more gameplay. And then we'll get back into it. Okay. But um, yeah. What do you guys think of this um? so far. I'm probably going to split it into multiple episodes because this will probably take me a few hours to read, so I'm probably going to just do a little more gameplay on this map and then probably get and um, yeah, so sorry I panicked guys, um, but we need to start working on the we need to start working on the 
Anyways, back on topic. I really think this is interesting. If you guys um want want to know how to play. Yeah, but anyways, let's get back on topic. Um, I've been, um, yeah, I've just been, um, playing a lot more of this game that I basically just got back into, and oh my gosh. Hoping, um, they have a map color, a sim map. Similar map, not an exact like copy of this map in uh, Call of Duty World War II, because I know because that is having zombies if you guys didn't hear. But um, hold on. So yeah, basically, been um where you first buy this MP40. Don't have enough now, my mom. But yeah, I should really go back and buy quicker buy first. But I am running out of ammo, so... Okay, got max ammo now. No, I got the Mauser. Wait. Still guy with me, okay. So, we can go back here. Okay, let's... I want to continue talking. But, yeah. I've just been playing, um... A lot more. Okay, but yeah. Anyway, um, this map is kind of um tight space. Oh my gosh! I can get anyway, um, okay. I could probably rush up there. But yeah, I'm gonna be doing reading up. Something like that, but I won't be reading it much more because you know I know you guys. Well, uh, it will kind of get boring after a while for you. See this gameplay, and um, yeah, this will probably be an hour long. Hopefully, so Need yeah, ammo here. thank you guys if you guys watched the entire thing. Like, you guys are really dedicated, and um, yeah, I do like making YouTube videos, and that's why I post a lot. And nope, 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 by the MP40, quick, and um, yeah. How does that work? Also, guys, I hope um, I cannot wait for this remastered. I hope they have like the original. I mean, the HG40 is basically. I think they might have the like original stuff, but then again, it's um. Activision, you never know what Activision is going to do, but... There's significance <coughs> in this recording. Yeah. Um, let me read the this last two pages, and then I'll just... I'll probably end the video, but, yeah. Okay. June 29th, 1945. Groff and Dr. S. developed the wave gun. July 5th, 19... 45. Rick Toffman travels to Siberia, f the Siberia facility, to further research on life specimens as her temper, her temporary go okay, guardian. He takes Samantha with him. Group 935 begins transferring three test subjects for experiment hold on let me zoom in a little okay now I can read it better Ex experimentation Na Nikolai Pablo and Takio July 29th 1945 
Wow. Rick Toffins works at the Siberia facility. Group 935 of Deadshot De or development of Deadshot Daiquiri. Okay, August 1st, 1945. The test subjects arrive at Sh Siberia facility for Rick Toffins experiment. August 13th or 31st, 1945. CIA hard nurse colonel blah, 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 confirms that Peter McCain has successfully infiltrated Group 95 and has been transferred to the asylum facility. Colonel subjects as Group 95 is losing control of their experience and has sent in a, a Marine recon unit to extract Peter McCain. Tank, Depth, Tank Dempsey is the lead is the lead to the squad. Peter is out as a spy and captured by group nine three five. Rick Chopper reports Pablo has died following a spleen removal. He also revealed that he he's performing experiments on Samantha. World War Two ends. Group 935 continues their research. Temporal rift begins to affect the asylum facility. An orderly report increasing problems with test subjects. After September 2nd, 1942. Many in the facility have begun hearing voices coming from the walls, including the sobbing of a boy and girl screaming and a man shouting for the children to close the windows, which we see in the map I'm seeing in the end, playing right now, and the cutscene. But, hold on. But, um, September 3rd, 1945, an outbreak occurs at the asylum facility. Peter McCain escapes. September 6th, 1945, Verrucht. Dempsey, John, John, Banana, John Banana, I'm going to call him. Is that really his name? It says John Banana right here. Smokey and a fourth Marine arrive at the asylum facility to find it overrun by zombies. They fight off the horde as long as they can. Dempsey is overrun by... <coughs> is... Oh, or... Captured by Group 95. John Banana writes his message and records his last words while being eaten alive by an undead Smokey. Rick Toffin, or September 10th, 1945. Rick Toffin reports another spy has been captured and while being brought to replace the Mexican, the said subject is Dempsey. September 13th, 1945. CP attempts with his um Colonel Penrill attempts to send a transmitter to Peter McCain telling him to <coughs> I need a drink. Hold on. I've been reading for a while. But yeah. Um, Peter McCain telling him to render this Rendezvous at the Rising Sun facility. Dempsey arrives at the Siberian facility. That's all I'm going to read. Hold on. Let me save where I'm at. Okay, but, um, yeah. So, yeah, guys. That's, um, basically the story of, uh, that's basically, um, so far, the story of zombies, which is up to, um, which is a triarch zombie, not exo zombies, <coughs> or um, not exo zombies, or um, not exo zombies, or warfare zombies. Only Black Ops Three, Black Ops Two, Black Ops One at war. Oh, only those. Well, hold on, let's buy you. I don't have enough money yet. Oh crap, oh crap, okay. This is where I end.
this is the end. This is the end of the line. Never mind. But, um, yeah. Also, guys, um, tomorrow I have a, a funny video with, with using the Herbert voice and, um, got cornered. But, using the Herbert voice, and, yeah, I'll see you guys in that video. And, um, I'll see you guys. Make sure if you guys do want to see more of this, like the video, and I'll see you guys next time.